Hey guys, so I just wanted to do this now. Uh, it's two o'clock in the morning. So I just wanted to basically give you the update of what happened today. Um, so as you guys know, I had to go to the job centre this morning. Um, at nine o'clock, I had to sort out what I had to do. The best thing about it was that with what I was going to do at the start of this year was save enough enough money to do my CSCS course. I'm doing it for the job centre, so it's free. So I'm starting a training for that next week. That's pretty good. Sorted all that out. It was all good. I went to my sister's to sort something out. That was good. Then I went to miss. I went with my sister down to Lewisham. Uh, we got a few things from there before she went there, and I came back here. Uh, and yeah, basically. When that happened, it was just after one o'clock. Yeah, that's what was going to happen. I was going to try and, because what happened was, is when I was at the job centre, afterwards I rang the pharmacy. I had to get my mum to pick up my tablets for me because I went there at the time. Um, which it was stupid because when I had to go to the doctors yesterday, they, like they told me to I I had to basically talk. I had to pop in to tell them to get doc my doctor to sign a prescription. Um, when in fact that day, at the end of that day, is when they sent off the prescription. So really I could have got it right at the end of the day before they technically closed, but they didn't ring me or message me. So that was annoying. I spoke to the cinema uh, and they, they found out on their end that they, the... Um, the code that I used for the cinema didn't technically get used, but it was showing that it, it did, but it didn't, if you know what I mean. So they gave me a free code, which technically I literally, as soon as I got that code and it said I didn't have to pay for it, which means I, I asked Dean, does he still want to go see the Joker? He said, no, nah, he's too tired. I said, okay. Um, I was going to wait for my dad to do it, but he was at Bowles, and then he had to go to Millwall after, so he couldn't. Then I was going to get Chloe to see a movie with me, but then I read on the email that it's valid for the next three months, but I can only use it once. So from the from three months of when I got the email, so that's good. Uh, so that's why I said to her, don't worry, uh, it, it's all cool, basically. Uh, yeah. And then basically watched all the videos up until tonight's. Literally, I'm even watching tonight's one right now, where he's opening an array quasar jumbo, jumbo hidden fates pack. Randolph, if you guys know, he's he's known for K, um, he's known for rapping with KSI. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, so yeah, I'm all caught up, seeing the new trailer for Star Wars, that was gorgeous, that was, oh, you can see a lot more detail this time. And the the tickets are already booked for the 18th of December, so I'm already going. <laughs> we were going to watch the 7th, 8th and 9th at the cinema, but Tom didn't want to do that because it was 445 minutes, which was uh, 7 hours, and I think seven hours and a half or seven hours 20 minutes something like that so he didn't want to do that um so we booked the individual one and we're going to watch all the other ones before it at, at the house obviously so that's better but this is still in december so it's like for farther along all 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 of them ones uh with the triple seven eight and nine they already all got sold out before because james was like it's all sold out, and I was like, how? Oh. And then I messaged Tom about it, and he was like, it's not. And he showed me a photo, and I was like, okay, that's it's, it's kind of weird. I don't know why it's not showing up for you. I know James is away right now, like, something something could have gone wrong, basically, with the way he's booking. And he was like, are you talking about a 7, 8, and 9, or are you talking about just number 9 on its own? And he was like, just number 9. Tom's a bloody idiot. So, um, yeah, that's already booked for the 18th of December. We're going to be one of the first people to see it at midnight. Going to be so happy, hyped to see it. Um, 
yeah so sorted that out literally for like two hours i was trying to figure out how i can use my ticket today to see the to see the movie or a movie today but then again that's when i read the email and it was all good for the next three months although i'm gonna probably use it next week so it don't matter and then i watched a bunch of videos at the time waited for my brother to get in sat there watching a bunch more videos then i told him all right are we going shopping he was like yeah so then i went to iceland with him got a bunch of shopping i didn't get no rubbish i didn't get no sweets crisp i was tempted to get like a two pan uh, vanilla gate or oh, a, a nice gate or oh, mate on the freezer section but all i got was just freezer food i got a six pint of milk uh, and I got these roll. I got some rolls, um, some baguette rolls, pretty pretty good. They're only eight p, so eighty p is pretty goddamn good. And then, so yeah, I pretty much got my lunch for the whole of <laughs> the whole of this month, and half the next month. So that's okay. Um, and then yeah, watched WWE Raw. That was pretty good. That was literally. A lot better than what I expected it. The only thing is they didn't show you is that when Raw went off air, there was technically another match with Seth Rollins and The Fiend in a steel cage match. And Seth Rollins won by escaping the cage through the, through the door. But they never showed it. And the only reason I know that is because when they, when I go on, if you go on WrestleTalk.com, they give you literally every update of, of WWE, AEW, uh, New Japan Pro Wrestling, all all different kinds of wrestling stuff, and that's why Randy Orton might actually go to AEW, as well as a few other people. You've got people extending their contracts in the WWE. They're getting paid more, so they stay there. Uh, what about what was that about? NXT. Say about Triple H. Think about NXT, think about DX. Oh man, it was so, there, there were so many things pretty much to say. And then that's when I uh, asked Chloe if she wanted to watch Doctor Who. And so we sat there for a bit and we were talking, we were just talking randomly about um, the movies tomorrow because technically tomorrow we're seeing, uh, what should I say today? Because it's two o'clock in the morning. We're going to see two movies today. Me, Chloe and Phoebe, we're going to see Zombieland 2 and then we're going to see Maleficent or Male Maleficent, uh, Mistress of Evil. Don't know how to pronounce that. Um, so that should be good. And then later on in the evening, me, Tom and George, around 9 o'clock-ish, are going to see the new Terminator film, Dark, Rise of Fate or something like that. So yes, you will see Sarah Connor try and kick Sarah Connor's ass. But it's the old one versus the young one. So I'm guessing the young one wins. Because technically that's how she'll get old. I don't know how it all, 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 goes, all goes down. But if you've seen the others, you'll understand what I mean. And then literally, it's, 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 well, it was about half an hour ago that we stopped watching Doctor Who. Um, Chloe went to bed. I sorted myself out, took my tablets, and I'm sitting there and I'm like, I'm pretty sure, I know I'm getting up early in the morning. I'm getting up at nine o'clock, so I'm getting up in seven hours, pretty much. Uh, which is fine for me, because I technically, yeah, I got enough sleep yesterday. And I'm feeling a little bit tired, but I'm pretty sure I can watch this video now, which is technically 11 more minutes. And then I can listen to music and go to bed while I'm uploading this. Alright guys, so uh, I was technically going to keep this until the morning and then do it. But I thought, you know, I'll get a bit of light off my laptop and I'll say what I need to say now. And you know what? This little one is technically sleeping next to me. Yeah, look at her. She's gorgeous. Normally she doesn't sleep right next to me. She either sleeps on my pillow here or in between my legs at the bottom. Don't know why, but she's sleeping right next to me. She's so gorgeous. 
I got, oh, that reminds me. You know what I had for dinner? I had a curry, a nice chicken curry. Oh my, no, a beef curry, sorry. When I went to, when I went to pay for the stuff, well, when, when I did pay for the stuff, I came back home and I was like, okay, why is it saying I've got five beef curries? When really, I, I got, no, four beef curries when I should have got two chicken and two beef. Obviously, I didn't look properly because I picked up four beef. So, uh, yeah, random. I know. That's why it rolls. That's why the cookie crumbles. So, guys, I'm going to go. I'll see you guys later. I know I'm not talking loud enough, but it's two o'clock in the morning. My dad's still awake a little bit. And everyone else is asleep, so I've got to shut up. Plus, the dogs are going to bark if they hear me. Because they're going to think someone's obviously come in the house, basically. I went upstairs and they started barking. So I was like, shush, and they still thought I was looking an intruder. Bloody hell, these dogs are crazy. <sighs> but we've got to deal with it. So guys, I'm going to go. My eyes are a little crap right now. I'm technically going to start uploading this in the morning and not now. Because I just want to end it and watch this and go to bed. So guys, have fun and good night.